welcome back. Our next guest has a number of questions to put to Derek. Meet Neil. Now, Neil's grandmother passed away last August, and he wants to know if Derek has a message from her. Hello, Neil. Welcome to you. Hello, welcome. How are you? Okay, thanks, Becky. Good. Yes. Take it away. Okay. Lovely to meet you, Neil. Nice to meet you. Hi. Neil. Now, just talking to you, and I've listened to Becky as well, um, I've just asked my guy because immediately um, I noticed that um, there was no one actually coming close to the atmosphere. However, I am aware now of a lovely lady who's trying to manifest to the left-hand side of you. If you start, don't be worried about it, if you start to feel any, like, slight tingling sensation, if you do, you might not, but if you do, and maybe around your hairline, that is your gran coming close to your aura. But I can assure you she's here now. Now, can I just say this to you, please? The lovely essence of the feeling that this lady's given me is that she was, um, most grands have got hearts of gold, so I'm not going to say anything different there. But this lovely lady that's close, was, there wasn't a harsh bone or a harsh um, link with this lady in her, in her feelings. She was like a motherly love. But can I just say this to you? With her, prior to her passing, um, there was quite a bit of what we call, um, uh, and I don't want to talk about health, but uh, it wasn't an easy passing, was it? No. Because she's given me the conditions as if in her passing, she struggled a bit, okay? and the pain and whatever, she's relieved of all those pains. She's in a beautiful spirit body. And if you've got a photograph of your lovely grand Neil around the prime of life, often we say here, 38 to 40, yeah. that's how youthful she is now, oh, okay? And she was a very pretty lady because I'm looking at her when she was younger, okay? Very attractive lady, your gran, okay? But she was very, very fussy because she's doing this with her hair. <laughs> very fussy about her hair, but wasn't something towards the end of her physical life happening here, please? Yeah, her, her hair went. What, would her, you... her hair went, it, she just like seemed to drop out and yes. she... Because now she's got a full head again when she was younger. That's Do great. you understand? Yeah. She wants you to know this. Great. And beautiful, okay? She also gives me the impression, you must push your wife. Push your wife in the most lovely way. She loves your wife, she thinks she's a good lady. In fact, she's not saying that thing, I know, I'm giving her 10 out of 10. Because, but then again, she's given you 10 out of 10 because you're a very caring man, you're very sensitive. You're more sensitive than most men. You don't care. You'll, uh, she said, she's watched him. So I said, what have you watched him doing? She said, he's not afraid to get behind the hoover and clean up and stuff like that. I think she's having a laugh. Yes, she is. <laughs> <laughs> she is. Because, let me say to you, that's what she's intimating to you, okay? Can you do a little bit more around the house for the good wife, okay, because she's working, okay? Right. She's not being nasty, but she's your gran. But she'd like to see you do that. Take the weight load off a little bit, Neil, okay? Okay. And, she, I mean, she does love you. Um, did she... Oh, yeah, she's talking about someone now. Bless her. Um, wasn't she uh, closely linked, your gran, to someone called Mary? Who, what was Mary to her that went over to spirit before your gran? No, I don't know. She was, you know. Oh, forgive me, I'm not being uh, pushy. No. Uh, I can't take that back. Will you check in your family link who Mary was, please? I will, yeah. And then you can get in touch with uh, Granada Breeze and tell them, okay? Yeah, I will. But she's met her and she taught your gran an awful lot of spiritual stuff when your gran opened her eyes over there. Okay. Okay? okay so you've got a bit of homework to do and get that vacuum out. Yes. I'm sorry, no. Hey, look, he's not going to. Don't think so. I think so. <laughs> get your pinny on. Cooking, cleaning, dusting. We want you to do it all, Neil. Yes. And unconvinced. <laughs>